How's the music? <laughs> Hi. Hi. What happened to you? Oh, I just jogged home from work. Why? Well, I want to get back into shape. Your shape looks pretty good to me. Oh, yeah? So tell me, how did it go last night? What did your dad want? Nothing. Well, nothing? The weight? Oh, I totally agree with you. He'd go insane. So let's just uh, avoid a problem. OK. OK. Well, there is one little problem that I can't avoid. And what might that be? Macy's laundry in the living room. Now, you may be used to her leaving her stuff all over the place, but I am certain. How does that feel? Oh, that probably feels too good. Oh, there's no such thing as something that feels too good. <sighs> Karen Spencer, you are a big tease. I'm not teasing. I'm perfectly serious. If you want a workout, Thorne, I can give you a workout. Karen, let's not get carried away here. That's exactly what we should be doing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, remember, we have house rules. Thorne, rules are made to be broken. Uh, there's the bell. Ignore it, OK? Mm. Look, you answer the door. I'm taking a shower. All right. But you better lock the bathroom door, or you might just have a visitor. Oh, you are so bad. Oh, Dad! Hello, sweetheart. Hi. Uh, may I come in? Sure, sure. <laughs> so, is, uh, Storing around? Uh, well, he's taking a shower. I'm sorry for all this mess. You know, I can't get over the fact that you two are living together. You know, when I was your age, something like that would never have happened. Well, Dad, things have changed a lot since your age. So, um, what brings you by? We have to talk about something. Something very serious. Uh, well, what is it, Dad? You've been in town several months now. Six. Six months. And you've settled uh, settled into your life here, haven't you? Oh, yes. I think I've adjusted completely. It's good. Because I feel now is the time for you to start looking for a job. Now, please, don't misunderstand Dad, me. I All have I'm been thinking the exact same thing. You have? Yes, I'm a grown woman, and it's time that I start supporting myself. Well, you never mentioned this to me before. Well, that's because I'm not exactly qualified to do anything. Oh, you're a very intelligent woman. Whose only experience has been waiting tables in a diner. And that doesn't make for a very impressive resume. Well, let, let's just, let's forget about the resume, all right? I want you to come and work for me. Come work for you? Doing what? You're an avid reader. You can start off by working in our fiction department well, as a proofreader. Very generous of you, Dad, but I can't. It's your family business. Which is exactly why I can't accept your offer. You know, I want to help you. I know, and I really appreciate it, but I really want to do something on my own. 
All right, what other interests do you have? Well, the fashion industry sort of intrigues me. Fashion? But have you talked to Thorne about this? No. I don't want to work with him either. I really want to do this by myself. You know, I really admire your independence. And my offer to you will always be open. Thank you. Listen, I have to run now, all right? So I will... I will... Wow. <laughs> this is some color. Is this new? Uh, yeah, sort of. Spectre Garrison. Don't you like it? Well, I mean, how does Thorne feel about you running around in uh, his competitor's label? Well, Thorne doesn't tell me how to dress, Dad. Oh, speak of the devil. <laughs> Bill, well, hello, Thorne. Hey, oh. this is a surprise. Well, I, I hope I'm not bothering you. No, not at all. Not at all. Look, I'm going to go change. Well, no, 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 no. Don't, don't, it's not necessary. Dad just came by to say hi. Yeah, I, I wanted to check up and see how you're treating my little girl. <laughs> Dad. <laughs> So, how are things at Spencer Publications, then? Oh, just fine. I mean, we're very busy. Our fashion people are uh, very excited about the new showing. Well, so are we. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's probably why you came by here, to do a little spying. Ah, well, you, you caught me. <laughs> well, you're not going to get any clues out of me, Bill. Ah, well, actually, I came to spy on you two. Us? Yes. You're living here, just the two of you? So, how are things going? Well, things are going just fine. Sometimes it's a lot of fun. But not always. Since I'm getting used to, you know. Mm -hmm. You know how that is. Oh, well, living together is work. Compromise is the key. But mostly, I'd say we get along just great. Mm. Um, do you go out at all? When we can. Hmm. Well, so you, you spend most of your time together here alone home. Yeah, well, as much as possible. Thorne has been so busy lately, it's... <laughs> Bill, you've never told me what a great cook your daughter was. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, we, now we split the household chores. Well, obviously, um, Thorne's a lot better off at it than you are. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was in a hurry this morning. Ah, oh, it's so good to see you both so happy. Well, we are. <laughs> Somebody help me with the groceries? Mr. Spencer. Macy. What are you doing here? Well, we're all having dinner tonight. Yeah, right. And that's why Macy brought the groceries over, because she's, she brought them over for dinner. She let herself in with the key. Yes, well, now, the reason that Macy still has her key um, it, it is because... Is because I still live here. What? I'm sorry, Karen. Uh, didn't you tell your father? N tell her father what? Bill, it's not what you think. Well, I don't know what to think. I thought you told me that you lived here. I, d I do. Thorn. Well, we all live here. What kind of arrangement is this? Look, Dad, this is an agreement between three mature and consenting adults. Thorn, I thought you were raised a lot better than this. Bill, you don't understand the situation. Oh, I understand exactly what's going on here. Yeah, calm down, okay? How dare you drag my daughter through this and make her a part of this, this disgusting display? He didn't make me do anything, okay? You didn't drag me in here. I wanted to come in here. Are you out of your mind? There's nothing going on. We all have our own bedroom. I don't want to hear about the sleeping arrangements. This whole thing is sick. Uh, you know, Bill, I would have to agree with you. You would agree? Well, if Karen were my daughter, I certainly wouldn't want her shacking up with a married couple. It was your idea, Macy. This is my home, Karen. And I'm not leaving. Neither am I. Why are you doing this? Because Thorne asked me to move in with him. Thorne, I am in... I am really disappointed in no, you. No, Bill, you don't understand. Oh, no, 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 no. I understood you. And now that was a mistake. Now, Dad, wait. No, 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 no. Now, listen, we will discuss this at home. I'm not about to ready to discuss it here. Not here! <laughs> 